Ladies and gentlemen, just imagine when dozens of elephants invade a certain kampong. Sorry. The story of landscapes of that kampong will never be the same again. Following this example, my research is interested in investigating the impact of an economic elephant called Iskandar Malaysia. It is crucial, it is vital, it is important to understand how has this project led to fragmentation of landscapes, agricultural landscapes, mangrove swamps, forests, and other cultural landscapes. In doing this, in tackling a complex issue like this, I use an interdisciplinary measure. You know, you have to use different lens of different sizes if you really want to see things differently. That's what I did. Hence, so I developed a model. And this model combines from elements from decision science and geospatial science. This has really helped me, and in the future, it will help in understanding and in how the policymakers and planning agencies respond to issues uh, in connection with this development. The results showed, as you can see from the screen, look at the red, compared 2006 and 2010. What are the changes? The picture speaks thousands of words. So the solution that my research, that my model emphasized or suggested, include realignment of planning policies and stronger engagement of the private sector. It is the private sector who is doing all this. So, this is very, very important engagement of the private sector because, you know, as the saying goes, if you want your belongings to be safe, then entrust it to a thief. Mr. Penchuri, thank you. <laughs>